Hi agents, thanks for joining me today. The topic is and or assigns. Now many of you, that may be a new term. For those of you that's practiced a lot of real estate, you've probably done an and or assigns before. And for those of you that do commercial, that's a fairly common term. What does that mean? So let me explain. Let's say I'm buying a piece of property, but yet I'm going to assign my contract to someone else prior to closing. So I would write in the contract, Melissa Steggers and or assigns in the buyer part of the contract. Now, what takes place with and or assigns or when might you want to use an and or assigns? And or assigns are used when you want to keep someone anonymous or you need to transfer it into like an LLC that you don't have made yet. So you're going to have to get the LLC set up and you don't know the name of it. Those are two very good examples of how and when you would use and or assigns. What are the requirements prior to closing or at closing? You will need to do an amendment to assign the contract to your LLC or your buyer that you kept anonymous. Uh, through that amendment is how you would do that. Or you can let the title company uh, know as well. And there's, it's a lot more complicated and I'm not going to go into that in this video, or you can handle it after the closing as well with the title company. But generally you do an amendment and it lets the title company know who is the assignee. So that's a little bit about and or assigns and when you might use it. If we can ever answer any questions, please let me know. I'm Missy Sagers, broker owner of M. Sagers Realty Partners, and we're always here to help.